Last week, I had some very annoying technical issues with my internet, which meant I couldn't do a lot that I wanted to do last week. So regrettably, I haven't prepared the manga quiz that I've wanted to prepare. But it is the end of the month, and I can't leave you guys without some form of manga quiz. So today we will be doing Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? We've done this before. I think we've done it like twice. You are zero and one. One in my favor. You guys are the losers. I'm the winner. Loser, winner. Loser, winner. Get it? But let's all get our thinking caps on and let's start Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? The big question is who is going to go first? Of course, if you do beat me tonight, I will run a marbles race and whoever wins the marbles race will be getting some free manga. 55% chat goes first. I'm going to end the vote there because it might sway back. In the past, we have allowed five categories. Two for any given category and we'll pick it. Geography, that's two for geography. Geography, manga, TV, Disney and Harry Potter. To be fair, I think I would like to do these as well. I think this is going to be an easy one. I don't think we need to do a poll. You guys have already got C. All right, you know what? I'll do a poll for the next one. Yes, absolutely. What movie is about the romance adventure of a cocker spaniel? You guys got enough for that. So we'll go for B. Nice answer. You guys are too good. You seem too easy. This is the beginning. I think you have to get 15 questions right. We've got 10 votes for... It is the right one. We all know this. You are right. What's the name of the potion that allows the drinker to assume the form of someone else? D, D, D. Everyone's going for D. Except for one person. Who did it? Mess up. Who misclicked? I think we're going for D. It's D, I think. It's D. You make it look easy. You got it. Press it by mistake. Kiki. Oh, no, you don't... Your Harry Potter ones. Where's the ge geography questions? The hard ones. Okay, someone did it again. Someone pressed B. I think we're going to be solid on this one and go straight for A. You guys now have £1,000 worth of manga that you can purchase. What explorer did Carl Fredrickson idolise as a child in the pub? Oh wait, no. I thought this was a geography question. I could tell no one knows because it's been like a few seconds and like four people have voted. We need a majority vote. Oh yeah, by the way, I forgot. You guys have lifelines. This is the smallest amount of votes we've had so far. 50-50. Okay, you know what? One more poll. 50-50, the answer D, or ask the audience. Wow, 10 votes on D. Damn. Well, a choice has to be made, so we're going to say D. <laughs> Guys, I think we should just call it quits here. I don't think I'm going to get past I this. You have recovered from your emotions because here is your new question. What's the name of the robber who adopts little Jonathan Joe star in Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. Come on, where are the Jojo enjoyers? You're confused with the question. I'm confused with the question as well. But then again, I'm not, I've, I've not read Jojo's. The majority vote by quite a lot is B. So we're going to go for B, Dio. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. After all this, you finally get a manga quick. You guys got it wrong. Nanny goat is up to her old tricks. It was poorly worded. Well, Sucks to be you guys. You've got six. Six questions right. Well done. I think your best is eight or nine. But I will do exactly the same categories. What fruit poisoned by the queen did Snow White take a bite of? It was an apple. Oh, would you look at that? A nice green apple. There we have it. The faces of which people have been carved on Mount Rushmore. Presidents. We're I'm not American, but I know this one. I reckon Kanye West will be up there one day. You what the hell is this? What does the Dunder Mifflin Company sell at the office? Oh, in the office. Oh, that's the TV show. Did we pick TV? Did we pick TV series? Let's take away two incorrect answers. I don't think this is going to help. I should have just gone straight for ask the audience. Oh, I'm terrible. B. Damn. I would never have guessed. Did anybody know this one? Because I know there's a British office and a an American office. Are they the same? Which of these countries has a red, white, and blue flag? I swear, this is definitely not Brazil. Sweden? France does. Definitely not China. Sweden has yellow in it, right? It's just yellow and blue. I'm just going to go see. Right it should be. It will be. Who gave Harry Potter his owl? I think it was Hagrid when he came out of the 
wizard shop, the, the wand shop. I'm going Hagrid. I'm pretty sure it was Hagrid. Halfway, all I need is two more questions. Who saved baby Harry from his parents? Just It was Snape, right? Oh, then it's Hagrid again. Good old Robbie Coltrane. Albus is at Pivot Drive at the beginning of the book and is greeted by Hagrid, which leads me to believe it's Hagrid again, but surely we can't have back-to-back -back. Um, Mr. Coltrane. That is correct. Chat, we are tired. If I get this one right, you lose again for a second month in a row. America is the capital of which group of Scottish islands? Why? <laughs> I'm going to phone a friend. My last <laughs> landline. Who out of all of my family and friends would know more about Scottish law? I'm going to go my aunt. My aunt would be old. So she would know. We're going to say a, it is. I have no idea. So I have to believe in my aunt. Suck it. Suck it, chat. Well, that puts me at seven wins. And you guys, at only six. I don't think we need to continue anymore. Who taught him geography? It wasn't me. I did phone a friend. Technically, you didn't lose because you voted the right answer. Well, technically, yes. But as a collective, you are all just as bad as each other. That was fun. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Thank you very much for indulging in another monthly manga quiz. And saving myself a little bit of money. During November and December, when I did all these manga quizzes, you, won you guys won every single time. You stole £150 from me. All right? So it's about time that I got a dub for one.